It's time for Movies Preview at Five Star. A resume of the upcoming three movies to be shown here at the Five Star Cinema on the premises of the Five Star Premier Residences of Dallas, Texas. I'm Dr. Mel Ginsberg, spokesperson for the movie committee at Five Star, and today I'll be looking at the resumes for the movies to be shown on Saturday, August 24th, Sunday, August 25th, and Wednesday, August 28th. So, let's get down to the resumes. On Saturday, August 24th, these days, we're showing old, new, or whatever. And the movie for Saturday, August 24th is Midnight Express. It came out in 1978. It lasts two hours and one minute. Its director is Alan Parker. The music is by Giorgio Moroder, and he won the Academy Award for Musical Score for this particular movie. Again, the music the composer is Giorgio Moroder. The adaptive screenplay also won the Oscar. It is by Oliver Stone. The movie is described as a thriller and a drama. It stars Brad Davis, John Hurt, Irene Miracle, Bo Hopkins, Randy Quaid, among others. And now the resume for Midnight Express. Billy Hayes, Brad Davis, is a young American caught by Turkish police while attempting to smuggle hash out of Istanbul. He's tried and sent to prison for four years where he endures all manner of privation and abuse. As he finishes up his time, he's shocked to learn that the Turkish High Court has added a further 30 years to his sentence. He is now demoralized and his life in prison grows increasingly unbearable until he concludes that escape is his only option and how he does it through use of the so-called Midnight Express is what this movie is about. Midnight Express will be seen on Saturday, August the 24th with a matinee performance at 2 o'clock and an evening performance at 7.15. And now let's move to Sunday, August the 25th. Again, our topics are old, new, or whatever. And the name of the movie for Sunday, August 25th is The Magician. The Magician actually is not a magic man. He is, he is a hit man. And The Magician came out in 2005. It lasts one hour and 25 minutes. The director is Scott Ryan. It's described as amusing, gritty, and offbeat. The movie stars Scott Ryan, Kane Mason, and a name I really can't pronounce very well, Massimiliano Andretti. Also, Nathaniel Lindsay and Ben Walker, among many others. And now the resume for The Magician. The Magician is actually a mockumentary that follows Ray Shoesmith, a Melbourne, Australia hitman who is similarly ruthless and caring, likable and volatile. It's being filmed by his media student neighbor for a university assignment. Ray is under contract to kill a lowlife of the Melbourne underworld when a more tempting offer is made. What's a hitman to do? Well, you can find out on Sunday, August the 25th, with a matinee performance at 2 o'clock and an evening performance at 7.15. And now let's get to our classic movie on Wednesday, August the 28th. And our theme for the month of August is Doris Day. And this coming Wednesday, August the 28th, we see Doris in a movie that is unusual for her, because usually she is a comedy or a musical or a musical comedy, but not this time. The movie is called Midnight Lace. It came out in 1960. It lasts one hour and 50 minutes. The director is David Miller. It's described as dark, paranoid, as psychological. It stars Doris Day, of course, Academy Award winner Rex Harrison, 
John Gavin, Myrna Law, I remember her, Roddy McDowell, John Williams, and Herbert Marshall, remember him. And now the resume for Midnight Lights. Kit Preston, Doris Day, is an American living in London with her husband of three months, Anthony Rex Harrison. One foggy night, while walking home through a particularly lonely park, Kit hears an ominous voice that tells her she will be murdered soon. She tells Anthony, who chalks it up as a prankster. However, Kit soon begins receiving threatening phone calls from the anonymous stalker. She and Anthony inform the police, but the police assume Kit is just a lonely wife in need of attention. Soon, even Kit's loved ones begin to doubt her sanity as she is seemingly hearing and seeing things that aren't there. Is Kit losing her mind, or is someone really targeting her? Could it be Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer looking for respite after pulling Santa's sleigh through the fog? Well, you can find out on Wednesday, August the 28th, with a single performance, the program starting at 7.15. And now let's recap. On Saturday, August 24th, it's the movie Midnight Express. On Sunday, August the 25th, the movie is going to be The Magician. Remember, he's not a magic man, he's a hip man. And on Wednesday, August the 28th, we have another movie that has midnight in its title. It's Doris Day in Midnight Lakes. And for the past few minutes, you have been watching Movies Preview at Five Star. While Channel 80 is dark, Movies Preview at Five Star can be accessed on YouTube. When searching, type in Premier Residences of Dallas. That's four separate words when you go on YouTube. Premier Residences of Dallas. Premier Residences of Dallas. A new show is posted every Thursday. Information for a movie playing on a particular day will be on the daily schedule by the elevators. Or you can consult our monthly schedule, which also features brief synopses of each movie. Movies Preview at Five Star is recorded live at the Five Star Cinema and is co-produced by Ebony Gonzalez and Arnie Renteria. Our director is Peta Solansky. For the movie committee at Five Star Premier Residences of Dallas, this is Dr. Mel Ginsburg. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you at the movies.